I can say that now we have a reasonably clear evidence that the number of malformation has increased com from 206 to 210 almost twice, 1.8 fold to folds. And the timing of this increase is like I, I have now data from 97 to 210 in terms of birth defects. From 97 to 206, they stay at a certain level. Mm -hmm. Then they start going up, and they go up continuously up to 210. I don't know if in 211, 212, mm -hmm. they will increase. Actually, I, we just finished uh, a study, yeah. and I think we will have, unfortunately, uh, to start all over again. Mm -hmm. Because for what I know, which is also the result of studies done previously, where we studied the contamination by uh, elements brought in the environment by the weaponry. Mm -hmm. So we proved that the weaponry delivered into the wounds of people mm -hmm. a certain set of metals, yes. among them many carcinogenic or mm -hmm. capable to produce malformation. And then we found same metals in bomb craters in the shell of white phosphorus ammunition, which are the same that have been used in Fallujah, by the mm -hmm. way. And we found also, a year after cast lead, contamination of the air of children, 95 children we studied, and at least 60 of them had high uranium, higher than, uh, than normal uranium values in their air, plus higher level for other toxic metals.